3 8 inch mild steel. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to make what's called a decorative leaf. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get this, uh, get this nice and hot. I get it to about a yellow, yellow orange temperature, which is approximately 18 to 1900 degrees. I take it to, that, to the anvil and I put a point on it. I hit it on one side. I just flip, turn it 90 degrees. I don't have to turn it 180. I don't have to hit it on all four sides because the anvil provides the other striking surface for me. Now I'm going to draw it out again. I'm going to use the edge of the anvil. So what I've ended up doing is drawing it out, making it longer and thinner. Take my ball peen hammer, use the rounded end. I'm just going to curve the metal in the wood. The reason why I'm doing it in a block of wood is because I have that pattern of the leaf on the other end, and I don't want to ruin that the vein. So now that's hot. Just put it on the anvil. Use a wire brush, clean it up. Cleaning all the scale off of it. Make it a nice shinier color, a little bit smoother. Now while it's still warm, we put it in the wax. Now I let this cool for a little bit uh, so the wax cools off. And I'll quench it in water, so it, uh, the reason why I don't quench it immediately is the wax will fall off in the water while it's still hot. And that is how you make a traditional blacksmith leaf.